welcome to Nora's Cove. I'm Yoshida. Today, we're going to be doing our weekly um, budget. And of course, I take you along with me. And you guys, there's nothing really to review. Like I said, I've been um, spent most of August in the hospital and all that great stuff. But um, I think this was my, this was last week. I guesstimated, I just went ahead and did it. I guesstimated 700, I actually made 631. Um, the week before that, I just put in, because I was late doing it, and I just half did this, but I paid off some things, but I actually made $1,025, EA. Uh, the week before that, that was my first week back, and I made $939, and as you can see, this is the week I made no money, zero dollars, but miscellaneous, I had to send. Um, and this is the week that I was sick. And this is all that I made was 165 because I worked that Monday. And then after that, I was just out. And that was 8 8. And yeah, and I didn't make any money that week. And then uh, this week, I went in like on a Thursday. Yeah, I didn't go into that Thursday. And even just working that Thursday through Saturday, this is what I made. So let's hop on into it. What is our new dates? Let's see. Now, I did go in and do my September calendar. I like to do that off camera. I always say, if you like to see it, just let me know. I did, maybe I did August calendar on Instagram, a real quick video. But this is September. And I don't, I think I'm done with this. But anywho, let's just get into what week it is. Also, I have, I'm gonna try not to be long-winded, but I have some new um, markers here, highlighters, the double ended, and I got these in my cloth and paper box. I was so excited. Um, I just thought this was great. So we're gonna highlight, ooh, it's dark brown. I probably picked the wrong one, um, but it's okay. We're gonna work through it. It's not a lot to pay this week, so I'm gonna get that. Um, I'm gonna try to hit cash envelopes. I'm sorry about that. I'm gonna try to hit cash envelopes this week. Okay, I want to work on debt, but I don't know because I'm trying to get rid of a bill. And now this thing may get stuck. Here we go. Okay, so this week we are planning for September. through the 11th per usual nail um hair hair is our number one source of income i'm feeling pretty good about this week but i don't know so i'm gonna put um 750 i know i have some large ticket items this week at work so i'm gonna put 750 um and nails i'm adding it back but i'm just gonna put nothing norris cove which reminds me, I need to send out a newsletter because I want to start a sale, a little flash sale. So I'm going to put $50 there, hopefully. And then miscellaneous, I'm not expecting anything, but you know, that's Lord want to bless me. So our total is $800 for the week, preferably. Okay, so starting on the fifth, um, I've already paid it, which is uh, credit one. So it actually will probably come out tomorrow, which is Monday. And that was $30, I believe. Okay. And let's see. I don't have nothing else to do to the 11th, which is uh, Chase. And my car note. Oh, I have a lot to do. <laughs> Chase, I think, is getting 40 my car note is 181.60. Also, I have T-Mobile coming out probably on Tuesday the 6th. And that would be 285, I think 96. I'm gonna round that off to 286. 286. Okay. And booth rent. 
And my goal this week is to give her 350, so an extra 100. And that is due Saturday the 17th. That's my goal. We may have to rearrange some things, but I keep forgetting the calculator. Let me go get the calculator out my daughter's room. Right. I have the calculator. I'm just gonna order me a new one because she wants to do cash stuff on videos as well. So I'll probably give her this one. Plus the, the one that I originally wanted was white, so. So our total is $887.60. We are over $887.60. Well, <laughs> that's how it, you know, only thing I can think of is reducing that, well, that's still not going to make any difference. So we'll just have to see how this week plays out. So we're basically in the negative by $87. Let me see if I got a, no, I got a red pen here somewhere. So we're negative $87.60. It's okay. <laughs> it's really okay because, um, again, the only thing that I could possibly do is instead of giving her $100, is give her 50 towards my booth rent, but that still leaves me with a negative $37. Um, Chase is going to get paid. Um, prayerfully, I have some money left over from money I left in my account from last week um, to cover bills and part of T-Mobile, so um, it'll possibly get paid, but it is what it is. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm still going to find a way to save something this week so that I can bring you another cash stuffing, um, cash stuffing video. So it is what it is. And, you know, I'm just going to go with the flow. Uh, again, this could possibly go up. I just got to remember, write a note to myself to do this sale. Um, and I will be doing coming out with some more new items. For my budget friends or anyone, let me know in the comments what it is that you need in the budget community what is it that you need in the planner community because i feel like a lot of things that i create just has already been done and um i got i'm working on something but i feel like it's there but maybe in just a different format so i would love to assist you in your planner needs and in your financial goal needs um, but I will talk to you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. And don't forget, if today's your first time watching any of my videos and you enjoyed today's video, please do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button. Also, hit that notification bell. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.